Okay, here's the problem I'm having. This is uh, the left main landing gear of the F-104 and I've got my animation helpers turned on and I've got my bones turned on so you can see what's going on. I have two bone chains, IK bone chains, one rooted at this joint which is a ball joint for a push rod coming over here to the bell crank second bone goes to the pivot point for this bell crank and uh, essentially a third bone sticks up here along the rotation axis. Uh, I have another push rod going from the other end of the bell crank with a bone to this control arm on the wheel mount and the second bone runs to the pivot on the wheel mount with the third bone going up the uh, pivot axis. <clears throat> I have two animation helpers here. One that controls the uh, vertical extension of the landing gear. So this is going to be, you know, your weight on wheels, weight off wheels, etc. And the second uh, helper, animation helper, controls retraction. If I retract, the bones tend to work. The system does what it's supposed to for the most part. You can see that the crank starts to spin and the push rods are pulling. But notice as we get to about 50 degrees, 60 degrees, things are starting to get a little out of whack on the wheel mount. We can see that the uh, rotation axis is pulled a little bit to the side. And if we look at the right side of the animation, we can see that for the most part, when we're fiddling with the rotation here, we can see that the axis and the rotation is pretty good up until about here and then it starts to get pulled. So we'll see that while this is lined up in this plane here, um, as we start to rotate more, it gets pulled and twisted out of plane. And that's the problem I'm having. And I'm guessing that I don't have the constraints set up either on this pivot point for the bone, the first bone, to keep this end of the bone up higher. I don't have some constraint set up there correctly. Or I don't have constraints for the rotation of this and this set up correctly. Normally they should rotate only about the um, about the y-axis here. Um, and it's not doing that. So if anyone has any ideas about what's going on with these uh, rotation axis problems. Um, I'd, I'd appreciate hearing about it. Thanks very much.